you see a girl walking around with a legit Chanel robot arm, obviously you're gonna look. Come on. It's like, I can go like this, I can go like this, I can go like this. I don't care when people stare because I know I look good. On dating apps, I'm very open about the fact that I have one arm. Just matched with this really beautiful girl. Okay. Um, and I asked her to come to Cubs tonight. I am a little bit nervous. Is she gonna like me? <laughs>
hot. You know, I'll do like some parents impressions. You know how that gets people going. I'm like, oh, my mom says, Dana, you better not take your breasts out. So like, <laughs> that usually, you know, makes people fall in love with me. The worst was like when I went on that date with that girl that kept calling everyone cold. <laughs> For like the most part, I really do love myself unless I like eat too much salt and my face is really bloated. So we're at Cubbyhole, my favorite lesbian bar in all the land. I think a lot of people would assume that I get nervous before a date if they're gonna react poorly to my arm, but like in reality, like I'm just like you, like I'm worrying, like does my breath smell? Like do my boobs look okay? Like do I look skinny in this outfit? I'm a little bit nervous. Being on camera is kind of terrifying, so we'll see. <laughs> I want other people to know that my disability can be funny and can be a lot of other things than just challenging or inspiring. It's not cute. Sometimes I get half price at the nail salon. Like there are so many like little funny moments in being disabled that kind of make the challenges worth it. It's like, oh, I'll have the balls to ask her out and then I'll and then I'll just put it on camera. It's like really up to fake. <laughs> the vampire, like yeah. Yeah. Alex, like Alex Fuck. Yeah. So I think Dana's extremely hot. She's extremely funny and really, really talented. It went really well. I, I don't think it's over yet. I hope so. I think I'm just going to go for it and ask at the end of this one. There will absolutely be a second date. If Dana's down, I, which I hope she is, but I would like to hang out with her again, for sure. I'm never gonna grow a limb, so I might as well enjoy this and embrace it and be myself. As a child, like, I would be so shook that all the things that I thought would make me stick out in a negative way, being gay, like having a disability, are all the things that like make me me and give me a story to tell.